How's it going, everybody? Welcome back to another episode of Booge Review. Um, so, I think this is my last miniature I've got left now. Um, and it's probably, I've probably said the best to last, I like to think. Um, now, this drink actually got recommended a very long time ago by my friend Elliot. Um, and it's Dura Scotch Whiskey. Now, I keep meaning to get a proper bottle of this, but... I'm just keep getting a bit priced out, like in terms of priorities as well. But now that we've all moved house and things like that, I think I'm in a better position now to actually go and treat myself to a bottle. So if this is good, I'm definitely going to get a bottle. Now, this miniature doesn't have an age on. So I, don't, I think this is just pretty much your standard bottle of scotch kind of thing. Um, I've read the back of it, there is no age to it. In fact, the box it came in is here as well. And now, there is no... Um, there's none, but it's fine um, because if it's good. I'll just go out and get probably the thirty-five pound bottle because I think if I do really enjoy it, it'd be interesting to put it against the uh, current winner of the verses, which is Highland Earl. Um, but we're gonna get straight into it now. So first of all, me usual. I'm gonna give it a smell. Hmm, it smells nice. Um, it's not too. Too overpowering, don't really hit you too much, which is what I like. So, quick flex. So, I got this really nice tasting glass as well, which I'll probably be using in future videos. And it also came with these. Now, they've not gone in the freezer yet, but I've got another six of those. That's my seven, eight, and nine. Um, but they're really fun because these rocks, so if you don't know what they are, they're pretty much fake ice cubes and they keep your whiskey cold, but they don't melt it and make your whiskey watery because I don't like that. So these are a really good idea if you like a cold whiskey, but obviously put ice in it. Eventually it melts, especially if you're just nursing it. It's gonna it's gonna just ruin your whiskey. It's gonna ruin the whole experience of it. So um, let's just get this poured into here and have a look at it. But it's really nice. Now, as a gentleman I was talking to not long back explained to me, colour doesn't matter in whiskey. So, because normally I'd say, oh, let's have a look at what it looks like. Obviously, it's nice and pale, um, but it doesn't matter. It does not matter. Now, this is a nice little bottle. It says fascinately, but I'm pretty certain I'm getting more out of this than I normally do with my miniatures. So, again, let's have another smell. Mmm, it's a bit smoky, um, which I like, because that's pretty much one of the reasons for me having bourbons. Like, I'm a big bourbon drinker. That is my favourite, I would say, out of any drink. Um, it's smoky though, it's nice um, It's again though, even with all this space now It's still not hitting me massively in the throat Or anything like that, so Yeah Smells nice, That's, yeah, it smells really good um, let's, have, let's have a go Wow Ooh. Wow, that's completely different to the smell. As soon as it hit my tongue, it was like hot, uh, like a burning, like a but like not like a horrible burning sensation from booze. It was just hot, like heat. And then when it went down, it really heated up on the way down. It gave me that shudder, but it went nice. Obviously, it's not one to be downing. But that was nice, it was really warm. Now flavour, again it's still got that really smoky taste to it. Like, I don't want to sound weird, but woody. Bit of a woody taste. It's nice though. Um, I'd say it's definitely better than um, things like uh, your Grants. Um, I think I'm going to save a bit of this actually. And do a comparison soon. So it will not be the last video with a miniature of Jura, or Jura, I'm not sure how to pronounce it properly, versus Highland Earl. But, I must say, that's really nice. It's not smooth, it's not smooth, definitely not. Um, but I don't tend to find scotches are. I find you can find smooth bourbons, definitely, which is always nice. But... I like to have a scotch more as like a reward to myself for something, say, um, not being sarcastic to an idiot at work. 
<laughs> now, flat cake, so like birthdays, things like that, I really like to use scotch as a real treat kind of drink. Bourbon's my everyday um, drink, it's really easy. Scotch is nice though, it's, a pr it's, just, it's proper, there's no mixers in this video, no mixers for my scotches because they, they don't get one. You, you don't mix it. It's not a mixing drink, you've got to respect it, I think. Um, but no, it's really nice, like, I don't want to get it all above my station, I'm not a professional at um, It's nice, I enjoy it, it's, it's, one, I've been, it's one of my favourites, I'd say, that I've tried on the channel. Um, and definitely coming soon will be the comparison, the verses. Probably, what's this now, round four, round five of the uh, Scotch v Scotch. Um, and if that wins, oh, fuck, I'm going to have to go buy a bottle out of it next one. <laughs> But no, um, yeah, that was really nice. I enjoyed it. I'm going to enjoy finishing it off now. Um, I hope you enjoyed this video. Drop me a comment. Let me know what you think about this video, about the drink if you've tried it. Um, let me know if there's any... Sc Sorry, we had a bit of an issue there with the recording. Yeah, let me know in the comments if there's any other scotch you think I should try. Uh, so my hands are everywhere. I should really just pop them down. Yeah, let me know if there's any scotch in the comments um, that you think I should try, uh, that you think could be better than this. Uh, because I'll, I mean, if you've looked at the channel, um, it's pretty much what I do, um, amongst other things. Um, but yeah, I'm, I'm always, I love trying new things. Um, I might not always buy it straight away, but I'm purely funding, uh, funding issues. But I will get it eventually. Um, other than that, like this video if you enjoyed it. Like I said, leave a comment, share it with your friends, show everybody how fantastic I am, and subscribe. Hit that bell, see every upload that I put on, and hopefully I will see you all in the next video. Bye-bye.